What's up, Tech King? Stefan here, back in another video. Today, we're going to be talking about the Human Digi X, the release date, and the specifications of this new device. Stay tuned. Guys, so Humidity is calling the Humidity X the new in-screen fingerprint value king. So they're gonna have an in-screen fingerprint sensor on this. But really quick, Humidity is having a contest, so I'll put the link in the description. You guys can go ahead and click on that. It's gonna take you to this landing page. But it says first 1,000 units X from August 26 get free U pods. So you're gonna get these free U pods. The first thousand people that actually order the Humidity X which is pretty cool. And also for the first 10,000 units, U-Pods will only be $10 for customers. So that is a really, really nice deal. Now, obviously the Humidity X has an in-screen fingerprint sensor. The other thing is that we have a 48 megapixel ultra wide AI triple camera. Hopefully the optimization is going to be good on this camera. I'm really, really hoping this is going to be a decent camera because Humidity hasn't had the best cameras in the past, but they seem to be getting a little bit better. Now it says we have a 6.35 inch AMOLED full screen, and I believe this is going to be a 720 p display now if you guys do know the galaxy a20 from metro by t mobile that was just released is 720p and that has an amoled screen as well so this isn't going to look any worse than 1080p this is probably going to look actually really good or pretty close to the a20 um samsung does have some really good screens so let's just hope this amoled screen looks good as well we also have a 4150 milliamp battery which is huge inside this device we have nfc inside this device and 128 gigabytes of internal storage now this is something that you don't see with budget phones usually usually budget phones have 32 gigabytes or 16 gigabytes of internal storage but on the Humidity x we're gonna have 128 which is insane so i'm super hyped about that now obviously this is the phone right here we're gonna have a little teardrop notch as you guys see right there now it gives you all of the features right here now, obviously the first feature that we talked about already in screen fingerprint sensor faster screen unlock so we have that a 6.35 inch amoled full screen stunning colors and high brightness 48 megapixel ultra wide AI camera. So we do have an AI triple camera on the rear of this device. We also have a 16 megapixel AI selfie camera ultra slim design but hopefully it does have a slim design i'm really really hoping for that uh we do have a 4150 milliamp battery and 18 watt fast charging so we do have a fast charger in this box multifunction nfc so you guys will be supported for google pay if you guys would like to use that 128 gigabytes of internal storage and it looks like we have the helio p60 high performance processor in here as well now i don't know how much ram this is gonna have but i'm i'm thinking it's gonna have probably like four to six since it is a budget phone hopefully somewhere near six that'd be great we also have global lte bands and dual 4g vo lte so that's great to see and we also have stock android 9 pi so that's great for smooth and clean experience now hopefully this is super optimized and it looks like it will be i'm super hyped about this phone though guys definitely tell me what you guys think in the comments down below but so far this is looking to be like a really really good budget beast now i can't wait to review this device i will be getting this device as soon as possible i know you guys are going to want me to review this thing and i'm definitely going to give you my full opinions on this device now i did look at a few of these slides but it's just basic stuff but it looks like we have super night mode so we're definitely going to be trying this out i'm going to be probably going to like little tokyo or downtown la or whatever and i'm going to be using this and shooting at night and we're going to see how this does i'm going to do a ton of videos with this phone and hopefully we see something really good from the Yum Digi X. Usually with these budget phones, we don't have super amazing night modes, but hopefully this one is going to be a good one. We also have AI scene recognition. Now it says AI scene recognition can intelligently detect all kinds of scenes and automatically adjust the brightness, contrast, saturation, and more help to create the perfect image. Now, obviously we don't know how the camera looks, but just as an example, this is how it's supposed to be. Everything's supposed to just be a little bit brighter, which is really cool. This is plain boom colors pop in so hopefully it does look like that it also says expand your view with ultra wide angle lens it says with ai correction to prevent distortion the incredible 120 degree ultra wide angle lens allows you to capture as wide as your eyes can see now this photo actually looks like it was taken in barcelona spain which is pretty cool because me and kevin went to barcelona spain uh, and i think it was on the same tower that we were at as well so that's really nice to see hog the limelight and enhance bokeh effect the depth lens with enhanced bokeh effect lets you blur out distraction backgrounds in your photos to make the main subject come to life so it looks like we're gonna have bokeh effects so i'm really really hyped about that looks like we also have ai beauty mode diy beautify and a face unlock so that's also nice to see in this device all right guys so these are the colors we're going to be getting it looks like we have flame black and it looks like we have breathing crystal i definitely want flame black it looks way better to be quite honest as you guys see right there flame black just looks way better than me way stealthier way cooler really like that so 
If you hear that, I want flame black even digi. I really, really want this color. This looks super dope. I have a ton of video ideas to do something with this. So really, really nice color right here. So yeah, guys, this phone is going to only be $249. Now we are going to have four gigabytes of RAM. I saw down here. Um, I scrolled all the way down to the right here, as you guys can see. So right here, it says four gigabytes of RAM. So we're going to have four gigabytes of RAM in this. So not a ton of RAM, but it's great for $250. Uh, but tell me what you guys think. I really do like this phone so far. It looks really, really nice. You guys can pick this phone up on AliExpress.com. But yeah, tell me if you guys are going to pick up this phone or you guys are even thinking about picking up this device because you guys may not even care. But yeah, tell me what you guys think in the comments down below. If you did enjoy this video, please leave a like down below as well as subscribing if you're not a part of the tech gang already. Also, hit the notification bell if you guys want to be notified every time I do upload a new video. This has been Safan from TechRite. Peace out, tech gang.